while working on the admin screens it is a common scenario to display data in the tabular form in this video we will see how we can do so using laravel and tailwind css so i have installed laravel along with breeze and i have created this product screen which is currently empty and here we are going to display our products using a table this is our product screen currently and if you see it is very similar to the dashboard file which comes rebuilt with breeze so let's display our table over here So let's see how it looks in the browser. So this is how it uh, looks. Currently, we have not applied any class. So uh, let's apply some Tailwind classes. And now if we reload the browser, well, this looks much better. We have applied some Tailwind classes and we get the desired output. Even though this is working fine, we see that we have a lot of uh, classes which is repeating. Uh, especially we see that for each column we have given this border, padding x of 6 and padding y of 4. So if we need to make a change, we'll have to change it multiple places. So we can instead extract it into a component within this component folder I'm going to create a new file and I'm going to call it table column dot plate dot php and this would contain let's copy this line and replace this with slot and obviously have to wrap it in curly braces and in order to use this slot we will replace this td with x table column and same thing we'll do with this td so now we've, we have removed the class which was repeating and extracted it into a component and use that component in our html let's reload our browser and we see that it is still working the same way however now if we want to change the padding or the border we just need to do it in a in our component well we can further improve our table by creating another component so let's go to our component folder and create a new file i'm going to call it table.blade Dot PHP and what I'll do is I'll copy this I would remove this T body and replace it with the slot and this header which needs to be dynamic I'll have a header over here and now within this view I can use X table close it out and I need to pass header as well as the slot so let's pass the X slot name is equal to header and we'll copy this 
into the header and rest of the thing we want to be rest of the thing we want as uh, the default slot so we'll pass it like this only and larval component will treat this thing as a slot default slot and this thing as the header we can remove our table and now if we reload we see that our table is still working the same way however now we see that we have removed most of our classes from outside the blade to the component these two components that we have created and now this way we can use our component x table at multiple screens without having to repeat any of the css classes so in this video we saw how we created a table using tailwind css and then extracted the table into a laravel component hope you have enjoyed this video please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel thank you